Matt Thompson's seven-year-old son, Zach, plays forward at Southdale Community Centre. He says parents and fans at this game are positive and supportive. That's not always the case. This was the scene at Southdale last year when a parent and coach attacked a referee. Many incidents like this have led some minor hockey associations to take action. You know, if you're yelling at your kid and you're being kind of verbally abusive towards the refs or an opposing player or even your own kid, then, you know, I mean, verbal abuse can be as hurtful to people as, as physical abuse and it can be even more hurtful. Now in Vancouver Island, parents are required to sign a code of conduct saying they won't be abusive at their kids' games. If they are, they will be banned for a specific amount of time. Could be a weekend, could be a month. If their bad behavior continues, their kids will be removed from the team. Whether or not that happens here in Manitoba remains to be seen, but Hockey Manitoba is taking some preventative measures. Yeah, there's a respect and sport program right now for coaches. Next year we'll be introducing the respect and sport for parents program. Winnipeg has adopted that program this, this past year and it went very well. The online course provides insight into the importance of a parent's role in minor hockey. Maintaining a respectful playing environment is something Thompson hopes his son can experience as long as he plays. Ready, Zach? Stephen Burns, RRC-TV.